Have you ever wondered the southwest monsoon rains, the ones that hit Mumbai like speeding trains, all go down the drain? Our generation requires salvation, and that is why thirsty concrete came by, a hungry and reliable source that keeps water running down our throats. A swish and a swerve around the curve was what I heard before. So now I see a glimmer of hope and hear lapping sounds from the lakes below. The material that sucks and slopes. I know it's absurd, but let's take this step forward and make ourselves a clean, green, water-conserving Indian road. Hi, good day. My name is Arya Patel and today I am going to talk about a serious issue that we see in our cities today and I am going to propose a solution. What do you think I'm talking about? RWH, that is rainwater harvesting. The most basic method of RWH is to collect water from your rooftops or compounds. This is only done at a building or society level. There is absolutely no public system for collecting rainwater in our city. Mumbai uses 4,200 million liters of water per day. I know it's a big number and I'm pretty sure other cities use similar amounts of water. Our forests take in 90% of the water that is supplied to them through the rains, while us urban cities only take in 10%. Aren't you all shocked? Well, I certainly was. All over the country, groundwater is being exploited using bore wells and pumps. We are just taking our water just because we can. Our aquifers are drying up at an alarming rate. We receive 2,000 mm of rainfall every year and with an area of 437 kilometers, square kilometers, the data from the Center of Science and Environment shows that the city can potentially save 2,400 million liters of water per day. It is not possible or feasible to use all the land in the city, for most of it is built, paved or in private ownership. So I am suggesting one of our public spaces that we all have. Our roads. Our road network is 2,000 kilometers long and what if we found out a way to uh, take rainwater and directly recharge the groundwater? Even if we just use 25% of our roads, we could harvest 30,000 million liters a year. That would mean 300 million liters per day every day during the three months of the monsoon. Now, how does one harvest this water? I am suggesting a new material that is in its early stages of experimentation called thirsty concrete. It is laid down like a regular concrete but has these mini holes in it through which the water then seeps down. It then goes through a bed of gravel and rocks getting fully filtered before it recharges the groundwater. I suggest that we lay these roads in low-lying flood prone areas to have a double benefit, more water harvested and no more floods. There needs to be a shift in attitude between normal people and the government to ensure the success of this system or any major change. As I said before, our generation requires salvation and our engineers and scientists have found a wonderful way to do this. I hope that in the future, we can develop materials like thirsty concrete on a large scale. This will lead to more water conservation and harvestation. Thank you.